I'm going to get a PK with pretty much every single special attack weapon you see in PvP today. Of course, the Excalibur does exist, but I'm afraid you just don't see it in PvP. I really doubt I'm going to get a PK with that. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to start with the AGS with the most overpowered, and as we go down the list, they get worse and worse and worse. Of course, most of these are still insane, but eventually I'm going to have to get a PK with a Dragon Longsword. So the first weapon... AGS and I'm on a 75 attack Zerka 99 combat max hit in my gear 71 I found another Zerka to fight. He's most likely got an AGS as well. So let's see who's gonna win ZGS to Gmall. Okay It looks like he knows what he's Doing if I'm getting PK'd already with the best weapon in RuneScape I dread to think how I'm gonna go on with the worst weapons. So I'm assuming this guy might have piety so if this guy is 75 attack with an AGS, he's going to be pretty low strength, but AGS is still going to be super powerful. So I'd usually use a Gmol as well in this situation, like either AGS Gmol or Gmol AGS. But just for, I guess, this case, let's just get the AGS KL. Good fight. Nice venge timing, AGS KL 67. Next weapon, Dragon Claws. Same again, I'd usually use the Gmol, but it's all about the venge timing. As we all know... Problem with using D claws is after you've used the spec, you don't really have much kill potential unless you bring the anchor. And then I'm risking 700k, so that is a big disadvantage because everyone else is risking like 250 to 300k or something. Anchor fight. You're not surviving this one. GG. There's the D claw KO. Next up is the G Mall. Technically, you could say this is the most powerful weapon, but you've got to use it with another weapon. You don't really want to just do three G Mall smacks. AGS to Gmol, Claws to Gmol, Gmol to Claws, Gmol to God Sword. So many variations. What should I go for? Ah, screw it. Let's go for a Claws Gmol. Let me just show you how powerful it is. You just stack someone's entire HP. is stupid. Oh, well, I'm sure you all know the amount of times I've used D Claws in my videos. Look at that. His whole entire HP just gone. Would be rude not to AGS Gmol. Let's go. You can't combo eat that. You can't. Wait, is this guy asking me to GL? Uh, okay. I mean, he's got full DH, which means he's risking the D boots. Don't you dare tell me you're using a DH axe as a main and a weapon. He, I, I've never seen this in the history of RuneScape. I've never seen someone use full DH as a main handed weapon. I'm just going to get revenge combos for days. This guy also has a fletching cape. Okay, well, thanks. You see a lot of people pretending to be a noob. That guy actually was a noob. I PK'd 1.4 mil off him. Probably took him about a week to make. Unless he stole his mum's credit card. What is going on? Uh, I mean, I could potentially get this guy. He's not even praying. I, I can potentially get him, you know. I actually CBA. I genuinely CBA. I did. What? Have you seen this guy's risk? He has Kodai everything. He's risking like at least 100 mil. Oh my day. What? <sighs> he had anguish, risking claws, ACB. I don't even know. Wait, who's the does this guy have an anguish? He actually does. So this guy's risking ballista most likely. Wait, what? He has a rune crossbow. I've never seen that before. Anguish and a rune crossbow because armor Sebo with a glory is just better. Anyway. It was nice knowing you. <laughs> don't even need the Gmall. I'm just getting the AGS KO and I don't even need the Gmall. Ready for this stack? I need the AGS Gmall. I just smited him. He didn't have a plus one. The one time I smite someone, they have nothing. Right, you ready for this? AGS Gmall smack. Are you ready? <sighs> I, I can't I can't get a Gmall in. Um GL? Like. He might be pretending to look like he's risking bang, but the thing is, he's most likely got an AGS, which means he risks the D legs, so that's good enough for me. Gonna have to get the Gmall KO. There's the AGS. Pretending to be a noob. Did I just- I just smited him. No way. Oh, I thought he was Scald. Wow, that's so good. In. Smited him for the D square. 600k PK. If he was Scald, that would have been an AGS. That's it. Oh, I, can't, I just can't get the Gmall in. AGS is just too good. Good fight. 
There we go, finally got it. Next up, the DDS. I'm gonna use range into the DDS and I'm also gonna be using an amulet of torture. The main thing I don't like about peers and zerkers, when you're doing range to melee, you have to switch like that to the prayers, you know what I mean? Like it's just, it's just a pain, like whereas rigor and pity down here, and so it's a spare bar. That was sick, that was sick. Nice vengeance as well. Ooh, dragon boots. It's like taking it back eight years, back when if you risked the boots, it was a really good PK, and it's just like that again. Look at that, 700k. Next is the heavy ballista, but I've got to get the KO with the actual spec. Not the best account to void range PK, because at this combat level, as you know from my dream PK account, you can have rigor and 70 defense. Perfect venge timing. I remember back in the day when no one really knew what they were doing. The meta was just a spam vengeance as soon as you get it. <laughs> Blister spec. That's gotta be it, there we go. 47. Next weapon, Bando's God Sword. Right, here we go. Are you ready for this beastly BGS KO? It was nice knowing you. I need to get a fight with the Void Ranger so I can stack the BGS properly. There we go. Look at that. 56. That was sick. Back to the Void Ranger for a fight. Dark Bow. I'm not using Dragon Throne Axes because I need to get the Dark Bow spec KO. So this is going to be pretty difficult because basically I'm just looking for that massive Rambo. And with Eagle Eye, it's not the best, but I might be able to get it because this guy's a pure apparently. Yep, there we go, finally got it. That was like my seventh fight. And because he's a pure, obviously it's gonna be a lot more accurate. That was a sick hit. Next up, the Zamorak God Sword. You'd actually be surprised at what this thing can hit. 57 spec. Nobody ever uses the ZGS spec. People use the ZGS, you know, for G Malta ZGS or whatnot. But I'll show you how good the spec is. Because you wanna fight people with range to melee and it freezes them for 20 seconds. So they have no KO potential on you. It's crazy. So now he's frozen, he can't do anything with melee. So I can just camp really low HP. And boom. KO. I'm telling you, it's an underrated weapon for that reason. His HP is pretty high, doesn't matter though. I'm gonna risk it here. He's full HP. Good fight. Man, look at this guy with a rapier. Never see anyone peek with a rapier, but he's unschooled. Here we go, Dragon Throne Axes, this should be insane. I'm gonna hit with a Blister Spec, so I'm gonna Blister Spec. Good fight. Okay, I didn't even get the Dragon Throne Axe KO, so that doesn't count. That's actually better than I thought. I honestly thought that was gonna be like 50k. Doesn't he just look so much more juicier in that Guthix, even though it's literally worth the exact same as Rune? Guthix Cape, this guy's definitely pretending to be a noob. I'm never gonna just expect him to be a noob, I'm always gonna expect the unexpected. See what I mean? Good fight. Remember when god armors used to be so expensive pre oc Like, it was a really good clue scroll reward. What is this? I remember I used to watch clue scroll compilations and people getting Sarah Domin and I was like, wow. Good fight. That combat, how did you know it smited there? Getting worse weapons now, next I have to get one with a Dragon Warhammer. However, I can actually hit a 63 spec and a 42 regular hit. Literally never see this weapon ever in PvP. Try not to get smited because this thing costs literally like 60 mil. Good fight, 53. I may as well try Dragon Warhammer to g mall because if the Dragon Warhammer hits, it drains the defense, which means the Granite Maul is going to be more accurate. I just attacked this guy, he's risking bank, and I actually could have got him, like, my Dragon Warhammer hit, like, nothing. See what I mean? Oh. Oh, that stat was sick. Next up, the Dragon Maze. This should be interesting. I've literally never used this in PvP, like, ever. Max hits are 55. That's not too bad. All right, here we go. Draconical Mace. Let's get it. We got it already. <laughs> sick. That was easy. Next up is the Blessed Sorrow Sword, and I'm pretty sure I've never, ever used this in PvP, but it's really good as a main handed weapon. It combos so much, but as a spec, it rolls off the person's magic defense if i can try find someone in melee armor it would be pretty accurate apparently it can have 52 which is all right 
drain 65 percent though i've used a spec quite a few times and it's so bad not one kill potential this is actually triggering Oh, I actually got him. Huh, finally. My only kill opportunity, and I get him. Abyssal Dagger. This actually hits worse than a Dragon Dagger, which doesn't really make much sense. Max hit of a 34-34 and a 40 regular hit. Yeah, I can't even remember the last time I saw someone peek in with an Abyssal Dagger. Oh. I actually got the KO, nice. Fair enough, I actually hit something decent. Next up, the Dragon Sword. I can wear a Torch Army with this because it's only 200k, so max hit, special attack, 47. This is my only opportunity to get someone by picking on the low levels. I've had like 10 fights with this thing and it's so bad. Oh, smited! No, we had a DDS. I smite everyone who doesn't have anything. That doesn't count because I didn't get him with a spec. AGS versus Dragon Sword, this should be fun. It's gotta be it, please! I hate this game, so that, that's happened like a million times, I'm not even joking. Yes, finally! Next up is the Dragon Halberd. I probably should have put it there, it's slightly better than the Dragon Sword. It can spec a 47 and a 43 regular hit. It's also two-handed, so I don't have to worry about the Rune Defender, and also it only consumes 30% spec. This guy's using an Elder Maul as a main-handed weapon. I can get some sick vengeance. got- I almost just KO'd him for crying out loud. He's not. He just switched to an AGS from an Elder Maul. I'm dumb. I'm actually dumb. Oh, okay. Good fight. Smited. I think I've got like four smites this video. Again, nothing. <laughs> the fake smite. I knew he was out of food, so he was only staying because he thought I was smited. Oh, that counts as a dragon halley spec. Cheers. And the last weapon on the list, the dragon longsword. This guy's volunteering to get humiliated by the dragon longsword. Brave guy. 48? What? Wait, did I just hit a 48? That's weird. I checked the max hit calculator. It says 46. I'm not going to include the coins because I did get PK'd a few times, but challenge completed. 